What's up guys it's the real deal welcome back to the channel guys today we're gonna to be pulling primal shards we've got 33 to get through we've got eight remnant summons as well and then we've got our prism shard pool as well um you know i do want to have like a little bit of a rant about primal shards honestly they are the biggest scam in raid and genuinely i hate them so much I mean, we've got a 1% chance to get a mythical. And, you know, for me, I'm end game, free to play. You know, I can clear all content. The only thing I can't be bothered to do is live arena. And I've got 33 primals over four months. So we're looking at one mythical champion every two years if we hit Mercy. It's just a joke. But enough about that. I don't want to rant about that all day. Let's pull uh, our Prism Shard. Very, very low chance to get that legendary. But I really want Razzlevarg. He is an absolute boss. Um, Hydra, Fire Knight, and also he's got tattoos on his ears. I mean, what more could you want? Uh, to be fair, he looks pretty cool. Like, I've never looked at a bunny and thought, what a badass. And Razzle Varg has proved me wrong. He is looking sick. Um, obviously, all of these legendaries are actually pretty decent, B tier and above. Um, another shout out to Wallmaster, like, absolutely broken for Hydra. Um, and then the rest, you know, I sort of got them like Roto's been probably the best or one of the best uh, arena champions. You know, Trunda, great for arena and Hydra as well. But um, yeah, let's go for it, boys. You know, you never know. We might go big and no. Okay, another Zagala. She's pretty decent. Um, I would actually consider empowering her for the Curse City. She, she, you know, I actually do use her quite a lot there. Um uh, Geomancer, Allure, the Fat Man, they're all pretty solid. Uh, Fane as well, great for Clan Boss. And I've just lost myself, so let's let's go for a 10 pull on the primals, see how things go. I'm really not expecting much. Looking like just trash at the moment. Yeah, pretty terrible. Pretty terrible. Oh, I don't know. I just, they really need to to do something about this because, I mean, even if you're a spender, I just don't think how can you justify having to spend so much money to get mythical champions? I just, it doesn't make sense to me at all. Like, that's a decent amount of legendaries, but still not quite good enough. I'm going to break it up. I'm going to pull one uh, Reman. Okay, Azure, pretty trash. Oh, ah, oh. I was like, is that legendary? No, uh, mythical? Nope. Rain Beast. He's pretty solid, actually. He was broken when he was first released into the game. Um, but he's okay. Like, he's good for faction wars, and that's probably about it. Can heal and revive, though, and hits pretty hard. This is just awful. So I think I'm... Oh, my God! I take it back, guys. I take it back. They're not a scam. Whoa. <laughs> Gizman the Terrible. I hope he's not terrible. Gizmark. Gizmark. All right. Um, probably not the mythical that I was after, but I'll take it. Um, feels good. Um, I was not expecting this. See, because they just, you know, they, they release so many mythical champions and, like I said, it's free to play. It's hard to get them. We're not going to be getting them. This guy looks pretty decent, though. Um, so in his normal form, before the start of this turn, places HP burn debuff on all enemies for two turns. Occurs once per round. This effect cannot be resisted if this champion's crit rate is 100% or higher. Okay, so he's thrown out HP burn. Nice. I don't qu quite understand. I can't remember around so i think is that every turn or is that like so if there's waves he'll do it on each wave but only once i'm not quite sure to be honest a3 let me am so yeah throwing out loads of buffs gets an extra turn as well that's a little bit dangerous for hydra i mean you don't want these to get stolen and then just blow you up in your face attacks all enemies um before attacking increases the duration of all hp burn debuffs on all enemies by one turn then instantly activates hp burn debuffs on an each enemy okay that's interesting this effect cannot be resisted 
if the chainmail's crit rate is 100% or higher. I guess you're going to have to build in with crit rate. Finally increase the duration uh, of the slows. Okay. And again, if it's critical. Okay. But yeah, he, he looks pretty interesting. I'm liking the kit. Let's just have a look at his other form. So we'll ignore, uh, we'll ignore defense. Uh, places a link pain link oh that is very new so obviously this is something that hydra does um i'm guessing it's i'm not really sure the mechanics behind it to be honest but i'm guessing it, yeah so you put it on the enemy though i always is yes, and yeah so you place it, the debuff on the target enemy for two turns and it cannot be removed or resisted when calculating the damage inflicted by the pain link debuff 75 percent of the attacker's skill Multiplier is reflected. The damage inflicted by pain link debuff will ignore hundred percent of the target's defense. Interesting. Throwing out torn unkillable as well. Also places torn and unkillable buff on this show. Really, really interesting. And ally protection ball. Ally protection and unkillable go hand in hand. Is that is busted? Okay. Kaboom. <laughs> Attacks to enemies before attacking. So it throws out um, decreased defense for two turns. Then. This debuff cannot be resisted if the target is under HP burn. Places an extra hit on targets with HP burn. And then gains an extra attack if he kills someone. Interesting. Really, I don't know, like a really interesting kit. I hope he's not terrible. I'm hoping he's like a solid um, champion. So we've got three more or nine if you include the remnants. So let's keep going, boys. I'm hoping we can get someone decent. Narhorn is an absolute beast. One of the best rares in the game. If you pull him, you want to make sure you are keeping him. And that's the last single pull. <laughs> Sepulcher Sentinel, great champion for early game. Uh, can use for clan boss and sort of just general content as well. <laughs> okay, so Regren. Um, Wergren. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know about him. I'm not too sure, to be honest. Uh, not not the best pulls. Um, would it, I need some more dupes, to be honest. Some more dupe epics so we can start empowering them. Uh, Kata Tomb, Kata Trash. <laughs> oh, Frig. Have you ever seen anyone that looks more generic than this guy? He is the definition of basic. Oh, uh, last one. Ragnar. So never used him. He just sits in my vault. Um, yeah, that's it, guys. I'm hoping you guys have way, way better pulls than me. But yeah, I can't believe we actually pulled a legendary. I just want to check him out. Uh, well, he's got to be Ogun Tribe. So what are his reviews? Wow. All right. So that should definitely help, like... Look at that, almost fives across the board. Um, obviously, Hydra being great, Arena as well, like my two favorite bit, uh, parts of the game. So yeah, pretty, pretty pleased with that. Anyway, thank you for watching, guys. Hope you uh, have way, way better luck than me. Please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. Make sure to smash, smash, smash that subscribe. And I'll catch you all in a video soon. Peace.